welcome back to my channel it is your girl miss cinnamon spice and today i am back with of course another wig review if you are not make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel okay you here i'm here we here join the spice girl and the spice guy team okay okay because we're gonna be slaying these wigs all 2021 all right you guys here and you've been rocking with me since day one y'all my a1 since day one thank you guys i love you guys y'all grow on my channel it's just i love it i thank you very much but anyways we're gonna get into this video so this wig um i ain't gonna lie you guys i didn't i still don't i'm still like 50 50 like 50 50 if i can really pull this off i sent a video to my cousin she was like yeah you look cute you good because i was gonna send it back to the wig company because i'm like mm, I, I don't think i can do this but she said i can so i think i can so you know we think i can so we're gonna try to do this right all right so this wig is from bam y'all already know where it is from it is from Amazon. If, if y'all see my nails looking a little like a little crazy, just just bear with me. Maybe y'all can't see it. See, I shouldn't even have bought it up, you know. Um. Anyways, this wig is from Amazon. This wig is from Meadow Meadow O'Hair. I don't know why I keep getting these wig companies that got these weird names <laughs> that I can't pronounce. So I do apologize to you guys and to the company. But I think it's called Meadow Hair our meat over here i'm gonna leave it somewhere over here so y'all can guys you know y'all can pronounce it how y'all want to but this is um where the wig is from i'm gonna go ahead and um show you guys how this wig looks y'all ready y'all ready um so in the in the in the bag here's here's the bag this is what it it comes in in this bag you have a a wig cap of course and then you have the wig okay so here is the wig you guys uh this is the wig here um i'm gonna take this off and show you guys how the wig looks completely let me zoom out a little bit so we can get a full view of this okay this is how the wig looks you guys so it is a orange color definitely giving me scissor vibes Give it, giving me the scissor vibes but like with a little bit more brighter orange you know what i'm saying so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how the inside of the wig cap looks here because i always do uh two elastic bands here the straps here and then we don't have a comb in the back i don't know if i oh, focus focus i don't know if i like that but we don't have a comb in the back but we do still have our two combs uh, right here on the side. And then we have a very itsy bitsy lace part for your middle part or side part, however you decide to style it. And this is the part. So first of all, there's a few things that we have to do to this wig to get her right. Because number one, I, I'm skeptical about the color, but like I said, my cousin was like cinnamon you can you can pull this off like you'll be you'll be fine so i was like mm, okay let's let's see um so anyways a couple things about this wig by it being a synthetic wig that i do not like but i know how to fix number one it is extremely extremely shiny and fake looking okay i don't like too much shine and too much you know fake looking wigs at all but i know this is a synthetic wig so i kind of expect that but this one is more on the cosplay super shiny side i don't know like if you guys can really tell how yeah you guys can tell like how really shiny this wig is it's extremely shiny number one number two this parting space we can't look at that we can't we what are we what are we gonna do with that we can't we can't walk around like that um so we're gonna have to play around with that as well and we're gonna get rid of this shine you guys know i have videos about how to do that before we tweak this wig i'm just gonna go ahead and give you guys some details about this wig so this wig is 28 inches long okay okay we got we got inches and of course it's synthetic hair and you know what this does say cosplay so this is a cosplay wig you guys so yeah we gotta tweak her 
we gotta make her look really really good because it is a cosplay wig so let's see how we can get this wig to look really cute and this wig is only $21.99 so it is a bargain I don't know we're gonna try this week here and see what we can do with her um so it is a cosplay wig $21.99 synthetic and it is 28 inches long and it is really shiny <laughs> um but you know it's synthetic so I'm pretty sure you know it might tangle and stuff like that anyways we're gonna go ahead and tweak her while I got you guys right here to kind of see if we can turn her into something else all right so let me do that mind my nails so first thing we're gonna do is we have our tweezers here and we're just gonna open up this part a little bit more because it's just not enough for me so I'm just gonna go ahead and pluck the hairs out of here so I'm tired of plucking so I'm just gonna take my um, scissors and just go we got it open up a little bit but I'm taking my scissors and just kind of go where I want the hair to be out and just kind of I mean how far how wide I want it to be and just kind of like go up in a line and just cut it out because this plucking is not worth my time <laughs> for this type of wig And I'm just going down and just grabbing hairs and just kind of doing that. Now I am going to get the hair out of my way. I mean get the all the hair that I plucked out of the wig or cut to a little bit better looking. Um I'm just gonna cut like a little bit more off of here. Okay. And then the little pieces that are left over, those come out, oh no, those tweezers. Those come out easier now. And then I can see. There you go. So I can get rid of those little pieces that are in there. Alrighty. So there we go. We opened our part up a little bit more. So we're going to go ahead and put our concealer in here okay guys so now the wig looks a little bit more like my skin color and we open up the part a little bit more and this is all of the plucking and cutting that we did in order to open up the part so I'm gonna go ahead and put her on so you guys can see how she looks on me um so I'm gonna Oh, get make sure I got all the strands of hair out and like I said it is probably a lot to do for a synthetic wig but you know some people might want to slay a synthetic wig shoot I might want to slay a synthetic wig so I'm gonna go ahead and put her on I did tighten up my straps okay guys so I have the wig on and this is how it looks like do y'all see that shine I'm talking about like we just don't want that shine to be there. I don't want that shine to be there. So I'm going to go ahead and first of all, I'm going to style this while I'm on camera with you guys. Um, so I can show you guys how to get it from looking like a cosplay wig to looking at least like halfway cute. Okay. So we already tweezed our part and added our concealer. So I'm going to twist my wig to the side. First, I'm going to get rid of this lace here. lace be gone so that's the lace part gone now and 
For the style that I'm doing, I'm just gonna go ahead and twist this wig to the side. I'm looking off in my mirror, guys, so sorry about that. If you see me looking over. All right, so I got it twisted to the side. And I don't even, like I said, I don't think I'm gonna even glue this. Well, we might, we might glue her down. We might glue her down. So now we got it twisted to the side. So of course you guys, if you wanna wear your hair like this and whatever, go by any means necessary, walk out the house looking like that, that's fine, that's you. Personally, um, I'm not. Uh, anyway, so all this hair is like stuck. All right, so we got her twisted to the side now. We got our part open up a little bit more. So that's how we looking so far. So the first thing I wanna do since we have her on and she's twisted to the side and everything like that is we're gonna get rid of some of this shine. So you guys know how we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that with of course our baby powder. So got this from the dollar store and we're just gonna go ahead and you know, put baby powder in our in our hair really quick because I have to dull it down. Now, I know there's some type of spray out there, some dry shampoo spray that you can put on your hair or something like that. I, I just don't know like how it looks or like what it does to a synthetic wig, but apparently it's dry, so I don't know. I guess it won't do much, too much to the wig. I don't know, but I'm gonna go ahead and, ah, it's pieces of hair just everywhere from when I plucked it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, put some baby powder on it because baby powder is a dollar and it's easy. Okay, here we go again. All right. Oh, I got it open on the highest level. We don't wanna do that. And I'm putting it all over the wig. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna get all over me too. Okay, I'm opening up a little bit more. And we're gonna comb it through, or brush it through. Just kind of dull it down a little bit cause yeah, it's too, too shiny for me. Alrighty, I got baby powder all over me. Like I said, I'm looking off in this mirror here, so bear with me. Zoom out a little bit so you guys can see me. Okay, anyway, so yeah, I'm just brushing the baby powder through the wig here. It's shiny, so we're gonna put a little bit more on here. This is actually really soft hair too. And look how it just combs straight through. It actually is like really nice. Okay, so yeah, that looks, okay. So I'm gonna do a side by side so you guys can see. All right. I don't wanna rip. I got baby powder everywhere. Okay, so side by side, I did a video like this with my black wig before. Now we're dealing with a color synthetic wig. So we're gonna do a side by side comparison. See if you guys can tell the difference. I am going to zoom in. Okay, baby powder. No baby powder. Baby powder. No baby powder. <laughs> Your girl, your girl got some tips here. Your girl got some tips here. Y'all, 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 y'all know how it is. Uh, but yeah, you guys can see the difference of how shiny, even sitting back, like you can't tell me that you don't see the difference here, how non-shiny this is. Like you see that, all right? You guys see the difference? So I am going to go ahead and do the other side now.
okay guys so somehow my mic stopped working and from here on out the whole video does not have any sound so i'm gonna be trying to do a voiceover and trying to remember what i say um so i finally got my hair completely uh with the baby powder now i'm just gonna brush it out and i'm just gonna pull this side down because i want to do like this slick kind of um slick kind of look so i'm gonna go ahead and get my tresemme mousse and i'm going to Put it on the hair here so that i can achieve this look that i want to go for um so i'm just going to go ahead and push that back and you definitely would need some bobby pins or some pins or something like that so i'm just going to go ahead and slick that back really quick so if you guys see my lips moving on the video but my audio is silent just understand that i don't remember what i said at all <laughs> like i tried i was gonna re-record a whole new video for you guys but it's the next day so i have to do that whole look over and it just would be so much and i had no idea that the audio did not record until i was editing last night to post for you guys and yeah the audio just my mic just i don't know stopped working so anyways i got my hair slicked back now i'm just gonna go ahead and put one of my um hair clips in my hair to kind of hold that back there and this color is actually like surprisingly looks really cute on me but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and do that okay guys so i put the hair clip in there now i'm just gonna go ahead and brush my hair just a little bit and as i'm brushing this hair i'm realizing like it is really soft like this hair actually feels like really soft and silky like it feels pretty good um but anyways i'm just gonna go ahead and brush that just to get rid of those tight curls that we had in there before you know i had already brushed it already so i'm just kind of loosening up the curls a little bit more Okay guys, so I decided I'm just gonna go ahead and slick that side um, down too. So the baby hair was kind of unnecessary because yeah, I'm not gonna see that anymore once I slick that side down. I decided to go for this kind of look instead. So I just took my Tresemme mousse and I'm just doing like a, um, you know, like a slick little side swoop as well. Pretty much how I did like the front. And I know I have baby powder on my forehead. So I know like right up there it looks ashy and looks really weird. But you know, whatever. I'm just going to take my hair clip and put it in. And this hair clip says love. And I think the other one says boss. So I'm just trying to, you know, get that right real quick. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. Really nothing too major. I just went ahead and slick both of my sides down with my tresemme mousse to get the desired style that i really want to go for and i added my cute little clips <laughs> y'all know how i do um and yeah and i brushed the hair out to get more of this like wavy kind of look and we added the baby powder so now it looks like a little bit different i really do like this color on me at first i thought i wasn't gonna like it but it actually looks really cute i actually really like it and this style is just something really simple really easy that you can do and as you guys can see the hair is more like a wavy texture now i mean it was already wavy but it's a little bit more wavier since i combed it out i guess it's more of loose waves instead of the tight waves that it had already came with um i just went ahead and brushed it out and stuff like that but we really didn't need much to kind of tweak this wig i just went ahead and slicked my hair down like i said added my pins to, um hair clips to it and yeah it really didn't take too much to get this wig together so it was very inexpensive i mean we really only needed two things so of course we need our baby powder and our um tweezers here baby powder was a dollar tweezers was a dollar at the dollar store you know the girl got some tips for you so it's all good uh, anyway so yeah that's how the hair looks right now i'm gonna go ahead and zoom out so you guys can really kind of see what it looks like like it's hair is actually if this was human hair this hair would be actually really gorgeous it'd be really really cute so I will say like I'm kind of feeling this hair you know your girl kind of looking kind of cute with this hairstyle or this color too I really do like it on me but I will suggest you guys glue your lace part down right there because the wig is going to keep shifting because there's no combs in the back to kind of support it so you know you need to put some bobby pins back there 
bobby pins on the side of it and also glue that lace part down or your wig is going to keep slipping even like mine y'all could probably see because i glued it down but then i didn't glue it down like glue it down so y'all might see like it kind of slipping back a little bit but you know <laughs> anyways um or you might not but yeah definitely make sure you secure this wig because it needs to be secure but your girl you know looking kind of good you know <laughs> you know looking kind of cute but yeah, like I said, I'm really shocked at how this like ended up looking on me. So you guys make sure you leave down in my comment box. Like, what do you think about this wig color? Do Is this something that you would wear? Do you think it looks good on me? Like, would you rock the style or would you style it differently? Like, you know, just go ahead and leave all that tea down there in the comment box for me. You know, let me know if this is something that you could rock. Are you like, nah, I'm not really feeling it. Or, you know, maybe you can pull it off this okay so i'm gonna go ahead and stand up for you guys so you can see how long 28 inches is on me i am 5'2 so the hair goes down to my hips and then when i turn around let me zoom the camera out just a little bit when i turn around you guys can see that it does go to my butt so you don't have to keep your hair with those clips in it that's just like a little style that i feel like doing right now you know nothing major but you can go ahead and take that clip out and just wear your hair down the um wear down to the side too and you can take your other clip out so this is how it looks if i were to do this style like it's still really really cute and really pretty and honestly this color is actually really pretty guys i'm gonna go ahead and stand up so i can show you guys how it looks like look at that curl pattern like that is some good little silky fake hair <laughs> like it's really really cute okay guys so i'm going to be ending this video um a few things I would suggest about this hair. First of all, I didn't think it was going to look this cute on me, but the color actually does. So I probably would try it in like a shorter hairstyle and not so long, but your girl kind of feeling herself. But yeah, um, I would suggest definitely gluing that lace part down. Get you some bobby pins because you don't want this wig to slide back because that lace part isn't really securing it enough so it won't slide back. So glue it down. Bobby pins tweezers and baby powder and yeah you should be able to achieve this like super cute little look style it how you want um just simple things to make your cosplay wig look a little bit better so yeah you can only do so much with a cosplay wig for $21.99 but I think we pulled it off so make sure you guys like share and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video bye